All right, this video might be going up late, but we're reacting to the Call of Duty Vanguard versus Battlefield 5 versus COD World War II comparison. It's probably not fair to rate Call of Duty Vanguard and compare it to other games already because the game isn't fully released yet. We've only had the alpha, but hey, this looks like a cool video to watch, so we're gonna watch it here today. Started off with the MP40 on Battlefield 5. Now, Battlefield 5 is an old game now. It's been out for like over two or three years, I think. And you know, it looks good. PC, it just really fun. There's no muzzle flash though. I've noticed that in like Battlefield, there's no muzzle flash. And that was a big thing on Vanguard that people were like complaining about was the muzzle flash. Look how much it shakes. I don't know. It looks a little bit more detailed, but still, still not crazy. And then <laughs> Call of Duty World War II, absolutely zero muzzle flash whatsoever. Like it doesn't even look like the gun's shooting to be real. The STG. I don't know. Call of Duty Vanguard, I am hoping they put a lot of uh, time and effort into it. But you gotta think, Modern Warfare 2019, it's on the same engine. But that game took years to make. Like, they put so many, like, so much hours in that making that game. Vanguard seems like kind of a copy and paste from World War II and Modern Warfare engine. It looks very similar to Call of Duty World War II. But, I mean, at the same time, that's kind of what it's supposed to be, so. The STG on World War II. It sounds a lot different, but animation-wise, there's just no muzzle flash. I don't understand. That's like a huge thing that they added to Vanguard with the muzzle flash, I guess. It's, it's actually night and day between Battlefield and Call of Duty. Like, this game just... The sounds, the graphics... It just doesn't compare, man. <laughs> it looks like a mobile game, dude. It looks like a mobile game. Now, this is obviously on PlayStation. Once we get it on PC, it might look better, but golly. It doesn't look that great. <laughs> it does not look that great, boys. Call of Duty is taking the L on this one, guys. Battlefield's always been like that though. Like Battlefield on PC will always be on top when it comes to realism and like sounds and stuff. They have just perfected it. Call of Duty's never been like that. Call of Duty's always been for like fast arcade shooters. Yeah, I mean, it's just a poor comparison. Modern Warfare 2019 was the first game that really brought the realism. Like they put so much time and effort into it. Modern Warfare 2019 was a super, super realistic and like, uh, just cool game, how much, uh, effort they put into it with the sounds and everything. So the Thompson was a big one on Vanguard, everyone complained about the, uh, like, the muzzle flash and stuff when you're ADSing, you can't really see, um, in Vanguard, so we'll see, I mean, comparity, like, there's a lot of recoil on that gun. I wanna see what it looks like on Vanguard, look how, look how crazy the flash is. I wanted to aim down sight to see if it really does make that much of a difference. Oh yeah, you can't even tell where you're aiming. It's like shooting the Glock 18s in uh, Modern Warfare 2. I do like this function though. In World War 2, they have a, a sh literally a firing range, like a shooting range. I wish they would bring that back in Vanguard. That's a cool feature that uh, we haven't really seen too much of. The Call of Duty franchise. MG42. So in Battlefield, you have to mount that. You can't uh, aim, aim down sight or anything. But obviously in Call of Duty, you have to. You can aim down sight. Dude, that recoils. Does anyone use that gun? The recoils trash. What the heck? Gosh, it looks like a turret. It doesn't even look like a gun you would really use. It just looks like a turret gun. Okay. You can definitely tell that they put some time into it, but it just does not look that great, man. Graphically, it just not look, does not look that great. I think World War II and Battlefield V came out close to the same year, which is really scary. I mean, Battlefield 5, I feel like it came out 2017, 2018. It's been out for a while. 
graphically compared to this game in Battlefield 5 is night and day. Although I will say, I don't know if this game is recorded on console as well. Obviously, PC Battlefield is going to look better than anything else. Car 98 is so good, man. I love it. I love it. That sounds exactly the same as World War II car. That sounds different, actually. Yeah, it's the same same sound. This guy's got some cool videos. I'm gonna link him to channel down below, but uh, go check him out. And uh, yeah, that's gonna be it, guys. That was a comparison. Vanguard, Battlefield 5, World War II. Obviously, Battlefield 5. It is recorded on PC. It looks better. It sounds better. You can't ask much from Call of Duty. I mean, they they really don't put that much effort into this realism. It's just into the gameplay. But hope you guys enjoyed the video. I am Logs and I'm out. Deuces.